Hi guys, my name is Johnny and today we're going to be talking about Rebellion DAO. Now this isn't going to be one of those projects where you would buy tokens and then it would emit like millions of percent in like APY and things like that. It's actually taking a more sustainable approach and what they're focusing on is universal basic income. Now this sounds really interesting, but the idea is that they're trying to create a platform where they generate passive income. Now, before I continue, I do want to give out a little shout out to Vrelia for showing me this project. And nothing I see here is financial advice. It is for informational and educational purposes only. And if you like the video, please don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. It really does help out a whole lot. Now, without further ado, let's get started. website and I'm going to walk through each of these steps with you and I'm actually going to participate live and see where this thing takes us. So let's go ahead and head over to rebellionbase.com. So as of right now, the citizen income is about 30 rebs a day and each reb is about 4 cents. And there's about 90 citizens right now. And let's scroll down. All right, let's see, how does it work? So there are two ways to participate. You can actually mint a Rebel NFT or you can purchase a citizenship with Reb tokens. Now let's scroll down here. Now it says here, limited quantities of Rebels are minted each week and each Rebel earns a minimum of 25 Rebs per day and you can upgrade them and I guessing the rare it is, the more money that you can make and you can actually activate it by sponsoring a citizen. Now, if we scroll down here, the rebellion citizenship is, I think, the main part of this ecosystem and it does require identity verification. So I did ask in the discord about where the information goes and you know, they do have a third party that manages all that and they actually do the KYC for a bunch of other guys. But I think what their main thing is they don't want people gaming the system. And the idea is that each person will have one account. Now, once you become a citizen, you get free rep tokens forever. You have voting rights, you have bounties for referrals. Now, how do you acquire a citizenship? You can actually be sponsored by someone that actually gives you that citizenship. It's also purchasable with rep tokens and then you can finalize citizenship with real identity verification. So let's go ahead head over to the dashboard here. So if you were to log in with your MetaMask, this is what it would look like. I don't have anything here right now. Um, this has become a citizen, get my three reps a day, which is currently valued at $1.36. All right, so here I'm going on to the dashboard. I'm going to go ahead and log in here, sign. And it says here I could become a citizen. I will earn 30 rebs a day. I do not currently have any Rebel NFTs. Now, if I go ahead and hit mint, there's a whole process. And I think the next upcoming mint will be on March 23rd. And it looks like right here, it's going to be kind of a drawing unless you're able to get a whitelist spot. Now let's go ahead and scroll down here. It looks like here, so if you are able to get these alien ones, you're gonna get a whole lot more rebs than these other guys here, but that's another option and I don't have one here to show you what that looks like. So we're going to go ahead and go down the citizenship route. So here, how to become a rebellion citizen. So let's go ahead and switch to Polygon here. I think we're switched over to Polygon, yep. We are, let's reload this. Okay, so it says here that it's waived with a Rebel NFT, which I don't have. And depending on where I live, you can see the multipliers. And when you click on this, it'll take you over to this space here. And I'm actually in the United States, so my multiplier will stay at one. If I'm in different parts of the world, I will get a multiplier based on my location. Now, I think that's the whole point of verifying your identity. So as we head back over here, if I want to purchase my own citizenship, I can actually do that for 600 reps, which is as of today's writing is about $27. Now I'm just going to go ahead and hit acquire and see that where that takes me. So it says there, I have to buy some rep tokens. 
So I have to acquire some Matic. There's some instructions on how to do that. But essentially what you want to get is you want to get a MetaMask. You want to go ahead and add the Polygon mainnet over to your wallet here with this information. And once you have that, you're going to want to send some Matic over. The next step that you want is that you want to go ahead and swap Matic for Reb tokens. So I do need about 600 of them. I clicked on this. It's going to take me over to quick swap. I'm going to hit I understand, hit continue. I don't have Matic, enough Matic, but I will use some of my Ethereum that I do have. So let me switch my networks over. And I need to get about 600 of these tokens. So we're looking at about 0.01. So I'm just going to go slightly less than that because I want to get as close as I can to 600. I'm going to hit swap and swap these tokens. Confirm. I'm going to hit close and wait for this to go through. So it's gone through. I have 603 rep tokens. I'm going to head back over here, connect my wallet, and then I can actually approve REBs. Hit confirm. And here I'm going to hit purchase citizenship with 600 rep tokens. So I'm hit confirm. And now I'm able to verify. So I'm going to hit verify and see what they're doing here. This at some sub, this is who that's doing it. So let's head over to some sub. Let's see. So this is what it looks like. Hit agree, hit next. Okay, so it looks like the verification has been complete. I'm not sure what to do after this. It's not giving me a place where I can click close. Oh, never mind. All right, let's try this again. Let's reload, verify. Not being sponsored. I am now going to be making 30 rev tokens a day. Cool. So that looks like it's about it. I am collecting this. And honestly, this is probably the easiest way to do it. So if I am currently, so if I'm currently making about this, I would probably break even in about a month. So there you have it. It's pretty straightforward, pretty easy. All I had to do was pay to verify my identity. Now I'm part of the universal basic income of this DAO and I'll be taking in about 30 rep tokens a day, which is valued at about four cents as of today's recording of the video. I'll probably do an update. I'm not sure how the mint's gonna go or the white lips are gonna go. I'm gonna look more into that. Now, if you have any questions or comments, please leave them below and I will catch you guys next time.